Good morning, everybody, and I've got my error message back on the microphones. Hmm. Anywho, oh, a little breezy out this morning. 55 is not too bad. I'm like, do I want long sleeves? No, it's really not that bad, but it's really overcast, and as you can tell, it's not very light out yet. All right, I'm trying to let some potties get happen here before we get. Well, that's kind of cool. Still out of the tree, the gray sky. So I'm listening to the weather when I came back home last night with Terry's car getting gas in it. And apparently Sunday's supposed to be 80 degrees now. It doesn't sound as much fun. Although we're going to be out pretty much in the woods, so I think we'll be okay. It'll probably be a little cooler. Just didn't want a real swelteringly hot day, but I guess shorts. I was wondering how I was dressing. <laughs> now I know. Oh, man. I don't know, at night, at 7.35, I was done. I was cooked. Of course, I never stopped moving yesterday, so that uh, would have something to do with that, but yeah. <clears throat> and then, so I laid down, didn't even import. Or no, I started importing, I didn't set the timeline up. But then I got overheated, got up, and then I was wide awake. But when I did lay down at like midnight, I, you know, <laughs> I had like a two hour nap and then I was good for the next like four hours uh, then I didn't want to get up this morning but here I am I'm awake barely no coffee no tea nothing yeah I really need to figure out that error message and I was right it did reset everything to zero on the uh and that's the only thing I did I finally changed the gain on the receiver to minus two and now it's giving me the file system error again so I don't know what the hell that's all about but you guys want to maybe like keep up maybe you know come on be in video for a minute <laughs> so the other day i noticed tracks over here and didn't pay attention very closely tracks yeah that one tree that was leaning so hard they finally took it down interesting didn't notice it until this morning that one was really starting to pull out of the ground at the bottom there I really wish I could go back and answer that question again because this is going to be a frustrating Sunday if I can't get... Oh, the microphones probably won't even be on. I don't know. But nonetheless, that unfiled, unsupported files format is a major issue. So, I reset the uh, DJIs again. I didn't do it yet, but it worked for a little while until I changed the game back to minus two on the receiver, and then this morning it's coming back up again. Uh, it just gets in the way. All right, this walk's almost done. I gotta get myself moving here because I got a Zeiss shipper to break down and get out before we open, and it's a real pain in the ass. Good evening, everybody. In this walk, we're gonna do some microphone testing because the DJIs are pissing me off. <laughs> Unsupported systems are some crap it's giving me every time I plug the mics in. If I cancel the camera app, it d does it all over again. Mateo, leave me alone. Yeah, if I close the camera app, if I relaunch it, I get this unsupported file system. Uh, like it's trying to save to a hard drive and it's not doing that. I reset connections. I didn't fit it. Fix it the other day. I fixed it by resetting the DJIs. And it's not fixing it now, so I might have to reset the phone. But I do have the roads connected as well, but that's not what we're on right now. All right. Turd Monkey doing his fire hydrant dance. And Priya doing her piddles. And we have an epic sky going on out here. Wow, that jumped all the way to 5x. I hit aim for two. <laughs> Let's try to pull that back. There we go. Yeah, so we're going to get some pretty cloud pictures as well. I'm not sure when I'm going to switch over, but I do have a different way of hooking up the DJIs that does not create the error. Only when I plug it in directly with the USB-C hub with, that came with the pack. Ooh. Jet flying. See how good we can get to him. Oh, it's going to get blurry. Let's see if it'll focus. Nope, not going to focus. Not at 15x, it ain't going to focus. Once we pull back to 5, you can, it's still out of focus. This is kind of an issue I've seen with the 14 as well, where focus on items in the sky really screwed up. Yeah, that's uh, pretty pretty tonight. Pretty pretty? <laughs> Tell time, is it? Almost 7 o'clock at night. I took a little bit of a nap in a tree. And I don't know what Priya's doing, but she's pulling me backwards. Come on, you already peed on a fire hydrant, and I got peed on a tree. Now you're nervous. 
<laughs> well, I think for tomorrow's test, I'm going to have to bribe Tim into uh, taking both dogs so I can focus on the cameras, especially with the issues I'm having. But yeah, after everything imported tonight, make sure the videos are good. I'm going to wipe this phone and hit headphones. I did that when I, read, when I reset all the settings this couple minutes ago, which is probably about 45 minutes ago. Um... <laughs> Been pissing with this thing for a while. That's why I haven't been outside vlogging. See if see if I hit headphones this time. If the error message goes away, because it will not record if that message is up there. And if I don't know it's up there when I'm doing this angle, I got no clip. So it's frustrating. I don't see anybody else talking about it. But I made that mistake that one time where I hit other syst other device because it's technically not headphones it's a microphone but i guess i should have hit headphones and somehow it's stored it in its stupid little iphone brain that it's a hard drive somehow i don't know but anyway okay settle down this is a test on how well the dgis do versus the road so let's switch over yeah and now i have my audio chime back oh god i miss you audio chime so this, when I, first, I, I've already had this thing set up. It never asked me the question to download the DJ or the, uh, excuse me, the Rode Central Go app on the uh, iPhone the first time. It did just now. So app is installed, everything's connected. Which do you prefer? The big test here for me is the simple fact that I don't even know if this thing's, a big thing for me is I'm not 100% sure if this digital audio cable USB-C to USB-C is compatible with the iPhone 15 Pro Max. I assume it is. And I am using my new right angle adapter. So the wire is in there nice and secure in the handle like I always did before. But I'm not going to break it because <laughs> it's aiming straight down, wrapping up through the handle. I'll show you when we get to the picnic bench how I have it set up. Because now you don't even have to spin the DJ, the 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 micro, the uh, receiver around. Pretty, pretty, pretty. I'm digging it. I hope I'm getting audio. I have it at a negative 12 on the gain right now. I did have it set up at negative 18. I will say with um, USB-C, it seems to be a much stronger signal because I'm progressively turning the DJI's down because it's peaking, even when I'm not yelling at the dogs. <laughs> Especially in the car, I feel like because you're surrounded by glass, there's a lot more, it holds the audio in better, and that's super loud. So I still got to work on that whole system because some of it is not even correctable with dropping the volume down a little bit. I see it, but it doesn't always mean it's like vibrating the speakers. Where are you going, dude? You want to pee on a pole? You wanna, okay. <laughs> so I don't know. Tomorrow, I, I don't know if audio is going to come out tomorrow because I'm going to have three cameras going. I'm not sure in all how I'm doing this. i got to pull out the bigger bar later on because I, th I just feel like the short bar is just not going to work for us. i got to find another little ru rubber seal to try to boost up the, uh, the double-ended quarter 20 that hooks in the center camera because it's sticking down too far and I can't put a tripod or a handle on it and that's going to need be a necessity. You're really getting on my nerves tonight big ears and the puppy is out and she's trying to pull me backwards. Not doing it. Got her out front now. <laughs> I will note that I am running a merged system right now for both the DJI's and the Rode. Um, but with the roads, you can now do stereo. Once I get the unsupported file systems error to go away, I will uh, hopefully fix that tonight. I hate to reset the phone, but hey, it's only got like 225 clips maybe, maybe more than that now. I've kind of been hitting record here quite a few times because people are driving down the road and whatnot, so. All right. Oh, it's a beautiful night. It's getting cooler out. Tomorrow, though, is supposed to be 80 now. It was not supposed to be that warm originally. It was supposed to be like 63, I think. <laughs> Boy, did that change over the week. Although where we're going, it may probably be in the 70s. Fingers crossed, because 80 kind of sucks on a hike. And then we got to carry water for them and for us. Not that we're really going to walk a whole far away, because I think it's like... 
a mile to the one waterfall, then you get back to the cars, we can give them a drink, and head out to Buttermilk Waterfall, and that's another mile. So, hopefully the scenery works out well enough for me to do this test tomorrow, because I want to get it done over with, I want to get that thing packed up, and I want to get it going back to Xfinity to get my trade-in money, because it could really come in handy right now, because it takes them probably about three weeks to mail the check after they get the device and make sure it is what I said it was. The only thing that concerns me is the fact that I have a Samsung only color, because I have the like the light blue, and I had to say white, because they don't have a light blue version on the trade-in. I have to say though, having the right angle and this cable and everything, oh, this is so much better than it ever was before. We're starting to get into some weird lighting here. There is one thing that I have refused to turn off and that's auto white balance. Some people are saying to turn it off because it'll affect it. I have noticed it. When you're going in and out of scenes with the 15, you seem to get like it, the colors will start changing. It'll get like a yellowish and then it'll finally correct itself. I've kind of, I, when I reset, cause I literally, when I reset settings, literally had to almost set the phone back up to zero anyway. So I don't really know what an actual format's going to do for me. But it's, I gotta try something, because I can't keep having that error message. I might have to go back to the roads for a little bit until I figure this crap out. All right, and back to the DJIs we go. Um, but this time we are connected with the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, well, mic jack, using an Apple dongle, USB-C for the iPad, to TRRS. And again, I'm not 100% sure if this is the right cable I need for this to work, but I'm assuming because it's Apple, it is. Hopefully we have audio right now. Um, it'll be interesting to find out. I guess when we get back to the house, I'll either be pleasantly surprised or very disappointed. And you'll just have a clip with no audio and I'll have to do some sort of a talk over or something, which I've never done before. <laughs> yeah, I've never actually done a voiceover. That's funny. Nine plus years and I've never if I had lost the audio, I lost the audio, but we're gonna, we're hopeful right now because this does not give me the error message, but this curly cable is kind of a problem. I don't know if I can sneak that down through the handle. So, but when we get up to the picnic bench here, it won't be the brightest, but I'll try to give you an idea at least of how I have it set up right now with this and I'll unhook this and rehook up the roads and go from there. So, oh, fun times, fun times. New technology and vlogging. Oh, so much fun learning everything all over again, even when you have things set up what you thought was the best way. And honestly, because using that, I have two of those 90 degree adapters, which is good, because I can actually plug one of them into the road and change how that cable comes out of it. So I don't have to have any other adapters on this thing, which I didn't before. So right now there's the DJI. You can say they got that little road curly Q cable. TRS coming into a USB-C to headphone jack, my 90 degree adapter. Found that on Amazon and that is a 10 gigabyte per second adapter so that the hard, that's what the hard drive connects with. So it's, uh, it's not too bad of a system, but like I said, this curly Q cable kind of gets in the way for the shift cam for the handle. I could probably run it a little differently. I just kind of like threw it on there real quick. But then with the D, with the road, I can actually use, I'm hoping this worked, this guy here, which is the USB-C road digital cable, and to get my audio chime. But with, in the past, especially with the lightning one, the port is on this side if I mount it. This can be mounted, the DJI can be mounted either direction. I just threw it on there right now so I could see the audio signal, but you could sw switch it around if you wanted to. Which with this cable doesn't matter so much. And it wasn't really mattering too much with this cable. So what I was doing with Samsung is actually using this end at the back of the phone and it worked. That way I got that 90 degree angle, but I got a 90 degree angle, so I don't need that. And then you got your straight one. So that's what I'm doing is this because it plugs in from the bottom down here. And I'll hook the road back up real quick here just so you can see. It's basically the same type of thing. I just use, I put the cable down through the strap to kind of keep it out of the way and it works really well. All right, so I'm not going to use the audio this time around for, for this particular part, just to show you when it plugs in, it does show that the battery is connected. 
so you know that the receiver is uh, actually connected to it. So let's fire that up. This does take a little longer to turn on than the uh, DJI's. Right, that's on, microphone's on. All right, so now back to audio. And like I said, I just use the, the, the strap for the wire. So it kind of keeps it condensed and you can still use the handle and hold on to it really well without the cable getting in your way. And this is what I'm talking about, how it sticks out. Right now, the road only can be mounted one direction. So that's why I'm always talking about putting an adapter on here so I could actually spin it around and have this facing out. But with this particular cable setup, it doesn't seem to matter. Of course, the one thing I don't know is how much room I have. Yeah, see, I run out of room if I want to do low angles or, lands or portrait shots. I can't turn it all the way down because I don't have enough cable because it's trapped back here. So eh, it's a minor little issue, but what I was thinking is if I put the right adapter on, stick it out here, I could actually plug it in over here and the wire might give me a little more space. Like I said, the nice thing is with the roads, you actually get your audio chime so you know you are recording for sure and you don't get so many error messages. You need to leave puppy dogs alone. Leave them alone. They're not doing anything to you. It's a pretty puppy dog going for a puppy walk like you are. Yeah, one of the neighbors was actually cooking out earlier when I walked outside with this turd. And uh, I think he said he was doing sausages. It smelled so good cooking. Come on, I'm gonna make you into a sausage for Halloween. Actually, I wanna do underdog, but can't find the costume. Yeah, I mean, this system is quite condensed still. Um, now that I have <laughs> right angle adapters and whatnot to do everything, so it's very convenient. That's, and the nice thing is with the handle, Switching hands while I pull a dog up a hill around a corner isn't too bad. So I can switch angles how I want to. If someone's coming up, I can aim a different direction. But overall, um, the road isn't too bad on this. Like I said, I would like to try the right angle adapter and see how that works for me though. Right, for Just for giggles, I've actually kind of switched the cable around. I put the 90 degree adapter coming out of the road and have the road cable angle into the iPhone. Now let's see if I can. Nope, I still don't have enough. Actually, I can probably give myself just a tad bit more cable. Pretty close. Yeah, I can. It's tight. I wouldn't want to do this for a long period of time. But it does work. So now I can turn the shift cam sideways and get a low angle of a bad little princess. Tripping. <laughs> I got that on film Priya. <laughs> Now just figure out how to hook the mics and the hard drive together at the same time and be able to record in 4K60. Thing is that took the uh, cable out of the way of the uh, Bluetooth button so I can hit record easier. All right, everybody. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little test and the vlog today. Kind of a little weird. I know, just trying to get things around for tomorrow. So after this, phone reset and hopefully I can get the DJIs to work without major issues um, going forward after this. So. Thanks for watching. Have a good night, and I will see you tomorrow. Adventure time at Buttermilk Falls.